Hi everyone, this is a video about this Walkman, Sony Walkman. The model number is WM-FX571. It means FX that it has a radio. So this is this, uh, very similar quality um, as the uh, FX571 that it didn't have, uh, EX571 that it didn't have the uh, radio and I told you I, I dislike that and it's making so much noise while using those mechanism and it has a gear in the back that is prone to crack and so on. Oh, it, it rhymed. It has gear at the back that is prone to crack. <laughs> that was funny anyway. Uh, so uh, this is the same uh, with the radio. The quality is more or less the same. And again, is the bottom feeder. It means you have to put the tape like this not like that and then it has uh, you can have this with a inline remote control and then a hold button here and then the volume and then you can operate this with a wall adapter 1.5 volt center positive and nothing anywhere else it has a opening here that you can see the tape that is turning. But you see something that I'm really, really annoyed with these people. Why they are putting it like this, halfway up. What, what the reason is for that? I mean, bring it down to show both of these that they are turning why you are going up there and it's so dark in there you cannot see anything here you see what i mean i mean this is about sony and so you know some of the panasonics is as well but panasonics is a little bit better uh, sony has the uh, you know somehow uh, i mean forgive the rant that i'm going on about as uh, most of them they have a small opening here or a little bit bigger with each model they are making it a little bit bigger and suddenly they are going all the way across and uh, this is ridiculous and all of them they are the same they are the same for instance this one it has radio that's it it is, is not really exciting and if you, you can put the battery in there and this one is, is in nearly great condition. You see, as soon as you put something in the battery in there, you just, did you hear the noise? Look, no tape in there for the time being. How much noise is making, you know, with every... This one, of course, is in great condition. It is it's just... Fantastic, but just imagine you are sleeping in a room with some other people and you just press the stop button, you know, this is ridiculous. You are going to wake everyone up, you know, other, other than, you know, listening to the radio. This one has a radio as well, let me just see, this one is radio on, radio AM, FM, and then stop for turning everything off and then here you have tuning tuning it uh, works with forward and upward downwards you know with these two and then enter is for you know preset settings when you select something and then you press the enter, it shows you the number of presets and then whichever number that you like, you just set it at that. And then up there you have a function here, 
Uh, you see, for instance, this one, when it's uh, in a black uh, background, uh, they have this model in black as well. So you can read these. And this one is, is very difficult to read them. I, I mean, I, I got it really close to you in order to have the perfect lightings to read them. Well, other than that, you can't see much of it. Anyhow, the functions is just uh, blank skip. And this one, it goes with the songs as well. And then you have the mode. Mode is for uh, auto reverse and then Dolby NR. The sound, it has three sounds, you know, normal and then uh, X bass and then groove. You can see that there. And then auto volume level system that is ear protection. And then FM mode is a stereo, mono and local. And that's really it. And that is the display. And if you press the radio on, it shows you the radio and the preset number here. And FM or AM. That's really it. And then we are going to play a song with this to show you how the sound is. The sound is, is, is not really bad. As I mentioned, in all of these, they have inline remote. Let me just see if I can find one. I show you. Just a moment. Here is one inline remote. I show you this one. Well, this one is not very advanced one, like uh, the 631 that it has LCD here instead of all of these buttons. Well, this one, it has fast forward, rewind, which you can use them for the presets as well. And then the play and stop. And then the hold, this hold is for this. And that hold on here is for the cassette player. And we have a volume here. Hello, yeah. That's really it, and this is the end of this. We can play this. It goes there. But some of, some of these uh, remotes, they don't take 3.5 millimeters jack for here. But this one does, and then... Oh, you. Oops. This radio is on. Okay, the volume. Let me just see. The volume is down. Okay. Let's see. Keep them under lock and key. And the set, for instance, now we are in the groove in the sound. Can you see that? And then you put the set, this is off, this is bass, and groove. And the Dolby, in order to go to Dolby, where was the Dolby? Oh, here, you have to press this. You see what I hate about this? You see, you have to press this for that little indicator there to go all the way around to go to Dolby. Let me just see. Where is it? Oh, this is the Dolby there. Can you see that? Then we go to sound off mega bass and groove, and this is auto reverse now. 
And this is fast forward with the Q. And this one shows AMS, automatic music sensor to go for one. And if you press it twice, it goes for two songs or three songs or four th songs. It depends how many songs you have on this. Because if you did not to throw... If it had left, I might have... I'm afraid we've gone too far. <laughs> Anyhow, that's it. So the quality of this is not bad and uh, I don't know why I have done this, connected this and I hold that. I wanted to show you what's going on there. Let me just rewind this. Let me see, where are we here? Okay, see. Okay, we want to go rewind. Let me see. Yeah, the rewind is not bad, it's going fast. Oh, I wanted to use this. Up. and okay you have to press it and hold it and you know what's happened here let's stop this and then you can have the radio here as well if you press and hold this, it goes to radio. Let me see. And it was all. Anyhow, this is not for this model, but still it works. I, I tried this before. And the price of this one. This one, it goes from 30 pounds because it has a radio up to 70 pounds do not spend more than 50 pounds on this because it's noisy and i don't like it but you know it's just in my collection because it's in good condition so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you uh put up with me i appreciate that because these are my rants about walkmans and i wish there would be uh, a company that they are making high-end uh, walkmans today but unfortunately is nobody is paying so much attention to what some of us want for instance the cassette player people anyhow I hope you enjoyed this video and until my next video, take care of yourself and each other and as always, have a great time.